Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you about the Fly Butane 4 jacket available at Revzilla.com. Now the Butane 4 is going to be an upgrade over the previous Butane jacket. What we're going to see here is improvements in overall style as well as true four season functionality. They upgraded all the venting on this to get you into the warmer months. One of our complaints in the previous jacket was that it wasn't really true four season into the warmer weather and they've addressed those issues with this particular upgrade. So Bernie to my left is going to be 210 pounds, 6 foot 3 and he's going to have a 42 inch chest. This jacket's going to have a nice American cut to it. We have Bernie in a large and it fits him pretty well spot on. So keep in mind, use the size chart and it works up very nicely with that. You might have to size down a size if you're right on the edge, but for the most part, you're going to be able to see that it correlates pretty nicely. Now, as far as colorways go, there's going to be a ton of colors for this. We have Bernie in the black and blue option. There's high viz as well as a slew of other options as well. So definitely keep that in mind. And sizes will range from small all the way up to 3XL. So again, plenty of functionality there for you. Now, Fly got their start doing racing helmets, and they've slowly adapted themselves to the entire moto community, working its way through the entire apparel lineup. The jacket that we're going to see here is going to come in around that $150 mark. And again, if you want to move into something that's more race cut, more aggressive, you can take a look at Fly's leather lineup, and they're going to have a few more aggressive options in there for you to check out. Breaking down the Butane 4, what we're going to see here, again, that four season functionality is really going to come into play without the, throughout the entire jacket. So let's start with that because those are really the biggest upgrades to mention. So looking at the shoulders, you're going to have venting at the shoulders and you're going to have waterproof zippers. So what that means for you is you're getting direct venting, direct airflow into your body. And when you zip this up, you're going to maintain the integrity of the waterproof liner. One of the things I want you to do, Bernie, go ahead and just unzip the jacket for me. And I want to start with this particular feature because this is a big upgrade. What they did was they actually built this new air induction system into the front of the jacket. And they're going to use magnets to hold the sides open. And you're going to see a massive amount of airflow through here. So you're going to bypass that waterproof liner and just put a ton of air coming through your chest where it's really going to affect you. You're still going to have a full YKK zipper on the inside, so you still maintain the safety of the overall jacket, but with, again, that massive amount of airflow. Big upgrade here, and the only thing I'd like to see as we move forward is maybe maybe one extra magnet right here, but either way, Fly did a great job of just improving the overall airflow for this jacket. Now, as you're working your way down the sides, you're going to see there's going to be snap adjusters at the biceps and the forearms, so you can fine-tune this down. You're going to see reflectivity working its way down the entire arms, as well as it's going to be worked around the chest and the belly area as well. The other thing you're going to notice is you're going to have adjustments at the sleeve in the form of a zipper. And then you're also going to have a Velcro adjuster on the other side, so you can fine tune that down as well. And you're going to see the full sleeve thermal liner peeking through. Again, four season functionality with this particular jacket. Bernie, I'm going to have you turn face away for me. Throw your arm up in that rider position for me. Now you're going to see slight pre-curve through the sleeve working its way down. Again, it's going to work for a variety of different motorcycles in your garage, whether you're a sport rider, a street fighter rider, sport touring. There's going to be a ton of functionality with this particular jacket. You're going to see the reflective piping working its way down the arm. And then as you work your way down the waist, you're going to see not only is there a Velcro adjuster right here, but you're going to have an adjustment gusset that's going to work its way almost, almost up to the full armpit, just giving you full functionality if you have a little bit more going on in your waist area. Now Bernie doesn't. Bernie's got a pretty svelte waist to him, so he can actually take this Velcro strap and just tighten it down, giving him a nice articulated feel. Bernie, you can throw your arm down and face away for me. Starting with the collar and working our way down, one of the things you want to know is you can't really see it, but underneath here, nice microfiber collar, really comfortable against the skin. And as you work your way down, you're going to see double layer of reflectivity going across the top. And again, they've really done a great job to improve the venting. You have a massive exhaust vent at the top of the shoulder, so as that air is pushing through, it has a place to go. Now working your way from there down, you're going to see one of the things with this jacket, very light branding throughout the entire thing. Slight fly branding along the bottom, and they're going to have that nice drop seat to it. One of the things this is going to be good for is if you're not using this with a matching pair of pants, you're going to have a nice drop seat that's going to fit over the jeans where the jeans end and the jacket actually begins. One of the things that I do want to throw out is there's a back pad in here, and one of the things you want to throw out is that back pad as soon as you get it. You want to upgrade this to a full-on back protector. This is really going to do nothing to keep you safe in a crash. I like to go with a D3O, trim it to fit. There's also going to be force field out there. You're going to be able to find a back protector that's going to work for you. Bernie, go ahead and turn around and face the front for me. And have, I'm going to have you unzip the, uh, the main zipper there. 
and just hold it open to this side so we can get a full look at that thermal liner. And you're gonna see, this is gonna be a full horseshoe zip liner. So it's gonna go up and around and you're gonna have that main zip to pull it out. And then once you get the, on, the zipper undone, you're gonna notice there's little snaps throughout. So you're gonna undo those snaps and the whole thermal liner just comes out. Even with the liner out, you're gonna have a nice comfort mesh lining on the inside here. So Bernie's just wearing a t-shirt with this. It's still gonna be nice and comfortable against his skin. Bernie, I'm gonna have you go ahead and just zip the jacket up for me. And while he's zipping this up, we're just gonna take one final look at the overall butane. Again, Fly has done a great job upgrading the butane four. They're gonna really turn this from what we had called pretty much a three season jacket into a true four season jacket. You have a full sleeve thermal liner, waterproofing baked into this, all for around that $150 price point. They really did a great job of making upgrades that are functional to this jacket. There's a lot of folks out there rocking Fly jackets. If you wanna hear more about what they have to say, do me a favor, click the info button, Check out what other riders are digging about the butanes they have hanging in their closets. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone. Give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Fly Butane 4 jacket. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.